I've been playing hockey since I was four or five years old. Uh, me and my brother are playing road hockey, uh, mini sticks, uh, outdoor pond, and then still have the same love of the game as uh, I did back then. I came to St. Cloud because of the, the great history of the program. Uh, they've done such a great job of uh, moving players on to pro in addition to, to winning championships. So I came in last year after, after transferring. Uh, we got off to a great start. We were winning a lot of games. Unfortunately, got injured. We were warming up for off-ice warm-ups before the game, and a teammate had jumped up and just landed on my foot in, in a really awkward way. Uh, it was such a fluky accident that I think if we did it a million more times, it probably wouldn't happen again. But uh, I felt the pain immediately. Uh, I tried to put some pressure on it, and I just couldn't. It, it hurt that much, so a teammate helped me hobble off to the, the training room where the, our trainers were taking a look at it, and that's when Dr. Martin first came in and, and took his first look and sent me off for x-rays that night. Uh, they said they'd review those, and then in the morning, uh, they told me uh, I needed surgery, so he r rushed me into surgery at uh, the Center Care Plaza here in St. Cloud, uh, where Dr. Jacobson, the, the foot specialist, and Dr. Martin, as a team, worked together to repair my foot. I wasn't sure if I, I'd ever play hockey again, which was, it was a really scary thought at first, but fortunately that orthopedic team with Dr. Martin and Dr. Jacobson did, did a really good job of letting me know that that wouldn't be the case, and after a long recovery, I'd be able to, to do the thing I loved again. Dylan clearly has a passion for uh, the game that he plays and so it's really great to work with somebody that uh, is so motivated and has such a strong desire to get back to their level before their injury. Um, so in a sense that makes my job a lot easier when you have someone who's so motivated uh, to get back to what they want to do. At the same time I think all of us have things that we want to do or we need to do in our own lives and so I try to take that same approach with all patients. The way he took it on and put the work in with rehab. He deserves the credit. He's done a lot of the work to get himself back on the ice and he looks great out there. I'm extremely grateful. Uh, I don't think I would be even standing here probably if it weren't for the, the way they treated me and, uh, and did such a great job uh, repairing what was a really serious injury. Centric Care Rehab did an absolutely great job of seeing me a couple times a week, uh, helping me progress slowly without going too far, pushing my limits to, to make sure that I was gradually getting back to, to doing the things I know I can. I like to say I'm a pretty uh, high IQ player that uh, uh, has a great skating stride and props to Centric Care for making, that, making sure that was still a strength of my game after the injuries. I was absolutely pleasantly surprised with uh, how unbelievable Centric Care was. 